We all know disputes among politicians happen every day, and the latest one in Macomb County is actually heading to court. As 7 investigator Jim Kurtzner shows us, this is all about power and money, who has it and who controls it. This dispute started with the county executive suing over the power to appoint advisory commissions. Then it escalated with the county commission counter suing over money. The issues here are good government. Uh, how do you how do you get the kind of government that's efficient, effective, and ethical? The Macomb County Commission last year moved to establish an older adult advisory committee. The county executive is saying not so fast. Can the commission create such a body? And even if they do, does the executive have the appointment authority for that body? This fire at the county building a few years ago required repairs. They're also doing renovations and restorations inside other county buildings and the courthouse that are still underway. The entire project was approved by the county commission, but when a change costs the county $315,000 more, county commissioners are counter suing, saying they should have to approve that. They're supposed to approve anything over $35,000. For their side, County Commission Chairman Bob Smith tells 7 Action News they're not alleging any mismanagement, just not following process and being completely open. We thought that the presentation to the board would be sufficient to authorize the signing of the contract. And then there are the finances overall. The County Commission wants access to the computer records, read only, not to make any changes in the records. Executive Mark Hackle says nope. We just don't think that some staff members should just be trolling through a sophisticated finance system. Uh, you want information, we'll be happy to give it to you. Both sides will continue to discuss this. If they don't get a resolution, it'll go before a judge within six months. In Mount Clemens, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News.